This is the SOG EVAC 18 liter sling pack. On the front of this pack here, we have a laser cut Hypalon Molly field for attaching accessories, maybe a med kit. The main body construction of the pack is a 500D nylon with a polyurethane coating. Provides a little water resistance and good durability. The front of the pack here, we have a quick access storage pouch. Have a mesh pouch, which is good for energy bars or maybe your USB cables and power cables. Have some pockets for a notebook, flashlight, pens and pencils. Big loop zippers here you can use with a gloved hand or your fingers. On the top of the pack here, we have our impact resistant molded shell. This is a very nice feature with dual zippers. Opens up. On the inside of that, we have a flap with eyeglasses or a fragile item storage. So if you do end up dropping the pack or falling, it's not going to get damaged. Have some more storage pockets for pens, batteries, flashlights. On the main compartment here, full access, opens up. You have some more storage compartments right here. On the top of the pack here, we have a zippered secure storage with a key ring lanyard, and this is perfect for wallet keys, things that you want to keep secure, but you need to have access to occasionally. Zip this all back up, and you have nice carry grab handle on the side, and zippered access to a laptop compartment. You can either do top-down access or bottom-up because there are two zippers there. It is a pass-through, so they have the same zippered access on the opposite side to get through to the laptop. On the laptop compartment, what we have done in the bottom half of it, there is a Velcro loop field, perfect for storing a soft-sided pistol holster for a concealed carry. And turning around to the back, you have our padded shoulder sling, quick shoulder disconnect, as well as a waist strap with a quick disconnect as well to cure it down. So if you're moving fast, the pack doesn't move around on you. And this is the SOG EVAC 18 liter sling pack. The 511 Rush Moab 10 or Mobile Operation Attachment Bag is part of the Rush series of premium quality gear packs from 511 Tactical. A high performance tactical go bag with room for everything, the Moab 10 gives you plenty of room for gear and accessories while offering extensive modular storage expandability that allow you to determine how your kit should be organized. The ambidextrous padded strap is fully adjustable while a comms pocket at the shoulder provides pass through access for headphones. A covert pocket at the rear is TacTech system compatible and large enough for a sidearm. There's an internal water bottle pocket that includes a pass-through port for easy hydration. The interior storage area provides ample space and a variety of admin pockets for optimal organization. There's extensive Molly Slickstick compatible web lining around the exterior that allows you to build your storage structure from the ground up. When you need to expand your storage compatibility for longer operations, the Moab 10 comes equipped with the 511 tier system, allowing you to integrate the Moab with other Rush Series bags. We've also added a fleece lined sunglass pocket. There's a sturdy grab and go handle and comfortable compression straps. The YKK self healing zippers are glove friendly. There's a hook and loop flag patch for added customization. This is the 511 Rush Moab 10. The cross hatch sling pack, a little bit of Velcro up front. A simple drop pocket, perfect for gloves. With all of our pack series, it comes with the modular compression straps. These are easy to move around and place where you need to on the bag. A full featured organizer. Small gear, medium sized gear, larger kit, a zipper secure pocket, key fob, and removable key fob. The bottom of the bag is left open so you can use the bottom of the pocket also for storage. As you move to the top of the bag, a fleece lined pocket. Please note also on the top of the pocket, an area for a six inch Velcro name tape. On the side of the pack, two rows of platform, perfect for those slim pouches. As you get to the side, there's a back sleeve, zipper with a bungee loop for locking, and it's a great place as you rotate this bag around your chest, a great place to keep your pistol in a Velcro holster. As you get to the main compartment, the zippers open up fully for that 190 degree opening. On the lid, you have two vertical zippers so that left-handed or right-handed, when this bag is on your chest, you can access this pocket. Two vertical drop pockets, and in the back of the bag, our Velcro panel, perfect for all those Velcro pouches. On the bottom of the bag, two layers of fabric, which is also a pocket, 
Velcro opening, perfect for a rain fly or an extra layer of foam, depending on the contents you're using. Small loops for sleeping bag rolls. On the back of the bag, high grade aerospace mesh with closed cell foam. A single strap with 12 millimeter closed cell foam, dual density. This strap can be rotated from left or right. And the cross body strap can also be positioned left or right handed. With any of our packs, if this buckle breaks, it's not an issue. You can now take the compression strap off and put it here through this loop and now you're ready to rock and roll again. A reinforced two inch webbing hull handle reinforced with plastic on that side. That plastic makes it a comfortable handle. A small tunnel for optional waist strap. The backboard, it can be used as a snow shovel. It can be used as a paddle, but also as a compression wrap. As you pull the compression straps off, it can be used in any one of these holes over any damaged limb. And so I'm gonna actually show you the actual bag that we used and how all the contents fits into the bag. So this is the 3V Gear Outlaw Gear Slinger Pack. It's a gear uh, sling style pack, goes over your right shoulder, and then as it slides around the front, everything is meant to be accessible from the top right here as it's still attached to your body. So let me actually just delve right in, show you all the good stuff in here. Water bottle, has a cinch strap to keep it all secure. Right here on the front, Molly webbing, which I use for uh, pens, pencils, uh, just a mechanical pencil. I got a uh, movers and shakers, tactile turn, a uh, Kickstarter campaign pen. Awesome, great pen. Here in the front pocket, various things, let's see. Cables, got a Gerber pocket knife, flashlight. You know, just stuff that you, you know, easily accessible, you might need. In the pocket right behind that, I have a few more pens. Micron pen, Lamy Safari fountain pen. Lamy, Lamy, I don't know, however you pronounce that. Um, we got a solar panel for charging my phone, camera, batteries, um, whenever I'm out away from the office, away from power. Let's see here. Batteries, battery pack for charging mine. Uh, it has a key lanyard, a couple keys on it. I'm just gonna leave that in there. Here in the top front pocket, I have my Fuji X100S. Love this camera, just carry it with me all the time. I mean, low light, fantastic, and quiet. Basically, it's silent. I also have uh, another pocket in here. I don't have anything in there. It has more Molly webbing inside, the elastic kind. Here in the main compartment, I have Rhodia notebook. I have another notebook uh, just to fill notes. Simple one, easily stick it in your pocket, carry it with you, uh, and easily have notes. Got an external hard drive, super rugged. Got the, the Bose noise canceling headphones. Those are a prerequisite. Um, let's see, fits a 13 inch MacBook Air, no problem. Uh, the Outlaw does not fit a 15 inch uh, laptop, but 13 lower, I mean, great. iPad, notebooks, other stuff. Okay, that's all I have inside. Um, big strap, has a couple zippered pockets in here, a cinch strap, actually keep everything nice and tight. Um, the back pocket right here, it's hydration compatible. Um, it's PVC backed, so you don't have to worry about water or anything else in there. Okay, and that is uh, the 3V Gear Outlaw Gear Slinger. Um, mine's all compressed down now that you can see, <laughs> nothing in there. But uh, I have one here, same model, just in black. Um, and it's stuffed to actually show you kind of how much stuff you can actually fit in here, how much gear. Um, it does come with a Y strap across the front. You can cinch down nice and tight. I removed mine just because uh, I don't ever put this much gear into like this pack. 